Hello Hi. guys, how are you? I hope you have some food ready because we're about to have the soju mini mukbang soju. Soju, 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 soju. soju in the soju room. We're not gonna drink that yet. We're gonna eat some food because yes. we're very hungry. I'm starving actually. I haven't eaten since the morning. I had this rice thing. We made some eggs. Oh, not bad babe. Oh, thank you. The eggs pretty good. There we go. So it's like a minced either beef or pork on rice with this strange buttery sauce. Not really sure. I have like a massive pot. I want to like show you guys. Mmm. You guys see that? Right it's here. pretty delicious. Hmm. This is what I'm eating from right now. That's a hazard. That's a hazard. <laughs> but you see it in a lot of Korean dramas. They just mm. like eat it with the pot and I really like it. And it saves you from mm. washing a few dishes. Try, try some of this rice. Oh, okay. See what you think. With some egg too. It's not hot. Sweet. <laughs> There's a really strange flavor to that. Yeah. What is it? I'm not sure. I don't mind it though. It's like a butter, butter yeah, soy butter, or butter, something. Butter. It's, um... it's quite strange. I don't have chopsticks. Oh, I don't have chopsticks. I'll be back. Okay. So this is how the Korean people usually eat. Well, I only see it in K-dramas. And they usually eat it with shin ramen. But I've got udon with me. Ooh. Is it tastier because you're eating it on... Top of a pan, mm -hmm. a pan lid. Oh, smells so good. This is such a good way to eat noodles. I have gin ramen and it's hot. I've never seen this before. There you go. Can you guys see that deliciousness? It's spicy. It's got some meat in it. We put an egg inside too. Oh yeah. Mmm, so okay. Good. This smells like more like a Chinese kind of two minute noodle. Oh really? It looks like shin ramen though. Yeah, it does. It definitely does. Okay. Ooh, smells good. Whoa, look at that. You get a lot of noodles in this cup. It's awesome. It smells really okay, good. Okay, let's try it. Oh, noodles. It's so perfect eating out in the mountainside right now. This is it, colder than it, yesterday's area. It was area. so cold outside. It's freezing. Like even with our puffer jackets, I definitely need like another coat inside of my puffer jacket. It's, I think it goes down to about negative eight degrees here. Mm. Yum. These are pretty good. It's like a uh, chili shin ramen, but lighter, more Chinese flavors. Mm -hmm. I would say like a Chinese two minute noodle. Oh, like Sichuan? Mm -hmm. Hard to describe. Let me how, try something. How about you just try it? But it does taste similar to shin ramen, but not as good. It's curry rice. So these are made uh, from instant packets. So you get a packet of instant rice and on top of that, another packet of the curry and you heat it in the microwave for about three minutes. We did it a little bit too long and it exploded everywhere. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, this is really good though. It's like, good. This is really good. I like this. Mm. How's that? Delicious. Very good curry. Very flavorful. Plus it's got an egg on it. So these eggs are quite cheap actually. You got convenience store eggs, four packet for about a dollar something. Mm. Pretty oh, really damn good. good. That's really good. Mm. So the era was saying at is still Gapyong, mm. but it's up in the mountains. You just keep driving and driving. It's about 30 to 40 minutes away from Gapyong station. Yesterday's Shin Ramen place was about, I think 10-15 minute, min minutes away, so mm. it wasn't that far. Whereas this one, the roads started to break apart, yeah. turn into dirt roads, and it's very windy here because we're in the mountains. So windy. But the scenery is really nice. Mm. And also, um, when we got here, there was like a, a Korean dog, one of those white, fluff, not fluffy, but really white style of Korean dogs. So cute. And a cat. The cat I named Soju follows me everywhere. I'm just walking everywhere. It just follows yeah, it wherever really likes I go. You. It's trying to like come into the room. Maybe it can smell the food. Next up, I got this Bolognese sauce sandwich. Gotta have a sandwich from a convenience store. And I've never seen this style before. Oh wow. It's like pasta in a sandwich. Oh, it's that just looks really interesting. It's um three slices of bread 
oh, instead three. of two. Look at that, guys. Can you see that? There's actually three slices per sandwich. What the, How do I eat this? All oh, right, there you go. It's like a wholemeal bread. You see that? So it's like the bolognese level, and on top of that is like a salad, kind of like a they tricked mayo us. salad. They tricked us with the wholemeal bread. Only the middle one is white, and then the two outer ones mm. are wholemeal. Mmm. You got tomato, lettuce, mayonnaise, and on top, a bolognese. Delicious. Really? Pretty good. I'm not sure if this is beef or pork, so eat at your own risk, babe. <laughs> yeah, so when we got here, very isolated, more isolated than yesterday. Um, there was like a grandma working here, does not speak a single word of English. Zero. We had to call our friend Sam to translate for us about taxis and how to get home tomorrow yeah. because if we can't get a taxi, we're not getting out of here. I don't know how we'll get home because it, it's on top of a mountain. And pretty much we're on top of a mountain right it's now. It's pretty hard because we don't know any Korean at all. Mm. Like not even basic Korean. That's part of traveling to her. We have toilet paper here. <laughs> oh, the fancy can. And we have four different types of soju today, guys. Two original or clear style and two fruit ones. The soju here is so cheap. Back in Australia, soju is about seven to eight dollars. Here, about a dollar thirty. That is why everybody is drunk on the weekend here. It is so cheap to get wasted. I'm curious to see what it tastes like. Wait, you've never had soju before, right? Never. Mm. Never, like not I'll even a that. sip, not even like any other flavors. I've just, I've seen it around everywhere, but I have never drank it before. Never have soju. Never in my life. Well, you're about to sleep in one, girl. That is crazy. I don't even know what to say. That is the weirdest background ever. We're just... It's so funny. Our mukbangs are just on another level, guys. We don't eat at home. We... We eat at soju, a giant soju bottle rooms. It's really cozy, like it feels like we're at home. Yeah, it does. In these it, places. It like, feels like if I was a millionaire and I had like all this money to spare, I would decorate a room like this. I would have an anime room. Yeah. I would have maybe like a hype room. And then I would have, what's my favorite food? A sushi room or a ramen room. Oh my God, a ramen room. I'll have the shin ramen room. And then, no, I'll have the no, udon room. I'll have a KFC room. And then I'll put those KFC candles everywhere, so every time you walk in, you just want oh my God. KFC. That would be so cool if they made a room, like, with a KFC bucket, and then you, like, mm. can sleep inside the bucket, and mm. it's just, like, decorated with, like, chicken everywhere. Maybe. While eating fried chicken! Someone should actually do that! Maybe when I retire from YouTube, I will open up a KFC room, and everyone can come and stay there. Yeah! <laughs> Let's do that! Because that's what... Um... Well, the Shin Ramen in this place, it seems like people just um, renovate and build their own rooms and make a theme. Yeah. They only have like two or three of them per location. And then they just have people stay. But this area is just so random. I don't know who would come out here. Yesterday, okay, fair enough. Mm. If you go to the Shin Ramen room, I highly recommend it. Hire the Shin Ramen place. Go to Nami Island. Yeah. You spend a day there. It's pretty good. But this Soju one, I don't, I don't know what we... We're gonna go outside later and explore. We wanna get fried chicken, but it's about 25 mm. minute walk away, so I might bring a, a butter knife to protect myself because that's all they have here. We'll try it out and see how it goes. I don't wanna get lost in these woods, but I'll do it for fried chicken, okay? But I think it's really nice if, obviously if you have a car, and you can drive yeah. yourself, but if not, it's nice to just stay away from like the crowded areas. It's really quiet, mm. peaceful. Nice to just relax, I reckon. Gapyeong is pretty, well, it's a very quiet area. Yeah. It's not busy. There's not much going around. There's a lot of taxis and a lot of service. Nami Island is pretty busy, but even then, it's it's a nice place to relax. Maybe on a better season, mm. during a better season, but I don't mind it. Get away from Myeongdong and the city life. Yeah. Seoul can be quite intense sometimes. And people are really oh. nice here. Mm. They're like, Oh my god. They're yeah. like extra nice. I kind of forget that I'm in Korea compared to like when we're in the city, you know? Yeah. People are just like, need to do this, mm -hmm. ah, just like all busy, need to be somewhere. 
And um, but it reminds me of Japan. Yeah, Tokyo. like here, definitely. Everyone's like willing to help you, and yeah, you know, even though they can't speak English, like they try really hard to. And it's made me like Korea a lot more. Yeah, we actually have a really cool story about the taxi driver. Yeah. He was so much help. Mr. Kim, thank you so much. I swear, if you come to Gapyeong, you have to call him. Mm. Get, give him some business because he helped us out a lot yeah. today. Because we checked out at the Shin Ramen Hotel at 11 mm -hmm. a.m. And we had to go here, but we didn't realize it was about 40 to 50 minutes away from the Shin Ramen place. And if we dropped off our luggage here, we would have to drive 50 minutes back to Nami Island. So what he did, he found us a place to store our luggage bags. There are no locker rooms at Gapyeong or anywhere around here. And we had nowhere to put our luggage bags. So he asked the tourist information center if uh, we could leave our luggage bags there. So we could go to Nami Island, explore it, come back, yeah. pick up our luggage, and then go to this hotel during check-in, uh, check sorry, which is 2 p.m. But we were very scared because, you know, we've never been in, we've only been in Korea twice. Yeah. We don't know if we can trust the people. What if the taxi driver just came back to the information center, took our luggage bags and drove yeah. off? What if the, uh, you, the ladies at the information uh, place took it? Or anyone could walk through and take it. It wasn't really secure at all. It was pretty much, you walk into the inf information center, they put it in the corner somewhere there. Yeah, it was just right there. So yeah. like, if you went into the tourist center, you can just take it. You'd be like, oh, that's actually my luggage and then take it. And they were like, we're not liable for this. You know, if you lose your luggage bag or any of your stuff, I had bags of shopping and they were like, if you lose any of this, it's not our fault, which I totally understand. I don't recommend anyone doing this, don't do by it. the way. No, no, like, no, no, don't no, no, just no, no, leave no. your luggage You don't understand. anywhere, this was... but we just kind of had no choice this was a last minute uh kind of decision for us we could have went to this soju place but we would have lost about 150 to 200 dollars. what are you doing are you chinese new year kind of line dancer why are you banging on that so loud what are you doing so we left it there but mr kim really helped us out he kind of chilled in the area near the information center making sure no one took it he gave us his card and said call me if you need me to pick you up a little bit earlier i'm happy to do it and he was just a really, overall, really nice guy. Gave us a nice little tour of the areas. Even though he didn't know that much Korean. He was just like, hey, hey, mountain. Hey, 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 gold. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So that was really cool as well. So Mr. Kim, thank you for that. Um, you actually saved us $200 and a whole bunch of time. We would have lost half mm. a day if we decided to do plan B. So we gave him a nice little tip and yeah. he was quite happy too. And yeah, that is our little kerfuffle this morning before we went to Nami yes. Island. Yes, we were really stressed out, mm. but lucky like we didn't like get into a fight or anything about it. Cause like, mm. you know, when you're yeah. both like stressed out, it's like really hard and you're both like trying to keep calm and then we have like filming to do as well. So, but mm. we worked through it, which was good. Yeah, cause it was like a schedule conflict. It was like a little bit of bad timing. Mm. We should have planned it a little bit better. We should have left our luggage bags at the Shin Ramen uh, hotel place then went to Nami Island mm. come back to the Shin Ramen place get our bags but you know things didn't go the way yeah. we planned things it. don't always go the way you plan so you just gotta be prepared for the unexpected it is now time for some soju we're in the soju room so I want to try some soju this is lime flavor how do the Koreans do it are they like they hear it like this I don't know, I've seen the guy like swirl it. Yeah, don't they swirl it? They like swirl it. They swirl it, they do like a tornado. Oh yeah, 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 there. And there's a whole bunch of uh, soju games you can play. For example, this lid game where you you can flick it off. We won't do that today. I'm gonna have a shot. This is uh, a bit of knowledge about soju. I don't know much about soju. I know it's just very clear. It's made from rice, sometimes wheat and barley. And it is also uh, not that much alcohol content. So that's why people can drink so much of it. Comes in a lot of flavors as well. I've been drinking soju since oh, not even that long. Maybe a few years ago. Not the, We're not heavy drinkers. We're not even drinkers to be, to be honest. But we thought... Yeah, we don't really drink and eat. Yeah. Yeah, it's not our style. Oh, it I'm smells. Mm, no, it smells like Sprite. Really? Yeah, it smells like... Look, tell me that doesn't smell like Sprite. Oh, yeah, yeah, it does. Okay, let's do it. Our first shot. 
One shot. Wait, this is like my first soju shot. I'm scared. Don't be scared. Are you serious? You drink so much freaking yoga bombs and tequila. Are you, you can't drink this. This is but so much know. easier like, to drink. I don't drink. know what to expect because I've never tried it before. And, uh, and like, I'm not good at trying new Kaja. things. Uh, I don't know what the Koreans say, so we're just going to say kanbae. What do they say? They don't say kanbae. That's Japanese. I know. That's why I said I don't know what the uh, Koreans say. Vietnamese people say yo. And Korean. We'll just say soju. All right. Okay. Three, two, one. Soju! soju! Cheers, guys. Soju in the soju room. Wait, do you take the whole thing? Can I just sip it? No. What are you sipping? Do it again. Do it properly. Oh my god, you're starting to annoy me, lady. I'm nervous. Just drink the shot. I'm like nervous for some reason. Alright, ready? Three, two, one. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Oh, yum. It just tastes like a, like Sprite with a little bit of vodka. <laughs> Are you serious? It wasn't even that bad. So soju, you can actually just drink with anything, any types of foods. Uh, apparently it's really good with this uh, deep fried pork, uh, but you can have it honestly with anything. Fried chicken, fast food, even this convenience store stuff. It complements food really well. That was not a good flavor. Oh really? I didn't like that at all. Well, no, That's no. my one and only. You're I'm not, going back to eating you're now. You're not drinking anymore? No. Are you serious? It's all yours. This is just, I have four more. <laughs> you have to try at least two more. Oh, One so more fruit flavor though. and the original. I'm it, not trying the original because everyone have to says try the original. original is the worst. It is not the worst. It is the best. You have to do it for the fans, babe. You know, in the social room. And you're only gonna have one shot yeah, I in did Korea. One already. That is very disrespectful for the Why? Koreans. Why? No, it's not. You can't just have one shot. Anyway, this is a milk custard bun. Some bread. Oh yeah. Mmm. Not bad. Are you eating more noodles? No. Really? You don't eat that much. You can have it. Oh how special. But you have to do two more shots. Yep. Yeah. I'll do one more. Do two more. I was gonna say three more, but two more. But you don't understand, it was really gross for me. <laughs> Guys, this is just unbelievable right now. <laughs> when she goes to the club, she bullies people to drink <laughs> ABC shots, tequila shots, Jaeger bombs, but and I'm not talking about one. Better. I'm talking about ten. I, it does mm, not it taste does. better. How does that? Jaeger bombs taste so much better than <laughs> this soju thing, okay? <laughs> I'm being Korean. Can you just give me a little bit now? Yeah, okay. All right, I'm gonna have one more shot, guys. I'm gonna leave the original for last. I'm gonna have this one. It's grapefruit. I couldn't get like the delicious flavors like watermelon or strawberry or your cool stuff I like that. I would love to try the strawberry one as my first Because the convenience shot. store did not sell it. I cannot believe this is only $1.30, guys. This is insane. $1.30 and that's from the convenience store. Imagine you bought it in bulk. Use it a little bit. There you go. How's that one? Good. Really good. Mm. This one here. It is custard and red bean. Custard really and red bean. Oh, the red bean looks really good. It's oh. really soft as well. You can mm. try this first. I'll eat it later. All right, let's do our shot. Okay. Let's go. This is grapefruit. So we do like an arms like this. Okay. Whoa. Love shot. Ready? Three, two, one. Cheers. That was probably worse than the other one. Wow. Wow, 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 guys. I'm, I'm drunk already. I'm very disappointed. Wait, why are you disappointing me? Are you? I'm very disappointed right now. At least I tried some. You have to finish it. But at least I tried some. Disrespectful for the Koreans. For the Koreans. Uh, Korean su. Uh, sumimasen, I'm sorry. She cannot drink half a soju shot. She is sorry too. I'll drink it for her. Cheers, guys. This one's uh, for you. Chink. Chink? Shouldn't have said that. <laughs> You should get, you should drink most of it because mm -hmm. you Why? talk more when you're drunk. That is true. I'm a silly drunk. Yeah. Let's talk about um, alcohol and when we get drunk, or I will. 
the most previous clubbing night and outing was for Delena and Twee's birthday, and I got wasted. It was not good. I, I don't know that was what like happened. The first time anyone has ever seen him wasted. I think someone roofied me that night. Probably a fan no. girl or a fan boy. Oh my god! I just got really, really sloshed. Mate, I got bloody sloshed. All right. I was like falling on the floor, dancing mm. with random people mm. and just being a... I, I don't remember much of it. That's why I'm saying I, I never let myself get into that position. Listen, all right, guys, I'm not that kind of guy. I just, uh, <laughs> I usually go out to the clubs and I usually just sit at the table and just mind my own business. Have a few shots here and there. Maybe uh, a few dance moves. You know, one of these, one of, one of these, one of these. And that's it. But something about that night, I don't know what it was, but it felt like I only had a few shots. I think maybe because I didn't eat the whole entire day because I forgot to. And um, You forgot to? Yeah. You just didn't want to. I was too you, busy. I was too you busy. You wanted to look good for the ladies. Yeah, I wanted to lose that 0.01 kilogram right before the club night. Even though they were, you know, doesn't really do anything. It just makes you drunk if you don't eat. Two shots and I was already done. What kind of clubbing girl is Delena? Would you guys like to know? She turns into another person, like an alter ego. I don't know if you saw the shots or the little snippets from Vietnam club night, but she gets hella slutty. No, I know. <laughs> hella slutty, what the hell? Not slutty, you just I get- I don't like- You just get what? Like, a really bit, like, a bit white girl wasted. No, I don't. Yeah. No. You, you, okay. You become a bully. Yeah, I become like more aggressive and like that's right. demanding. That's true. She becomes yeah. a real aggressive person. Like you know, she would make force people to drink shots that they don't even want to have, and then she'll like. Delaney never swears. All right. In the five years that we've been dating, she's never sworn at me. Yeah. Or even like said. I generally. Shit. I she don't. Never says shit. I don't ever. swear. But when she all. drinks, yeah. But when I drink, oh my I start swearing. god! So it's really weird. She becomes like a Martin Scor Scorsese movie. There is so much swearing. She would be like, "You effing little bitch! If you don't drink this shot, I will effing okay. cut you!" I blow it. She becomes a gangster, pretty much. I think she just becomes a gangster when she drinks, yeah. I and think she was... bullies people. She goes, "If you don't drink this shot, you have to carry me." In the club, she tells guys to do that for her. What? So the guys what end up carrying mean? her around the club. What do you mean? No, <laughs> what the hell? Why are you making stuff up? And um, she, uh, you know, punches people, attacks people. Pretty intense. Anyway. I'm not that aggressive. What do you mean punch people and attack people? Here's the soju that we got from the hotel, the room. I keep calling it a hotel. Sounds better when it's a hotel. What, are you drinking? Are you sobering up already? Is that why you're drinking water? Are you that lightweight? Wow, okay, this look at this guy. Is probably... I just want to enjoy my food. I don't <laughs> like eating food with uh, and drinking alcohol That's at the right. same time. You get really red, yeah? Listen guys, I'm a bit tipsy. Some of these stories may or may not be true. We'll never know. Ay. <laughs> That's a big booby. <laughs> this is his favorite. Something's wrong with that nipple. You better go get that checked at the doctor's. Let's open it a bit. Oh. Oh, wow. Babe, you have to one shot this one. Otherwise, I'm, I'm not going to. Who's the bully now? You I'm bully people be. all the time as well. Yeah, I do a little bit. But so? I bully people when I'm sober as well. Yeah. It's the same. So you can't say that. You better drink. You better drink. I'm not bullying. You better drink. Wow. <laughs> have one of that. You can chase it down oh. with the, the brick. Okay. One last shot. This yeah. shot is to Korea, South Korea, for being so kind to us, giving us the amazing mm -hmm. food and the amazing opportunities. Um, the Korean gods, AKA Korean Jesus has blessed us very well. And we cheers to you. <laughs> Brace yourself. This is probably the most alcoholic tasting one, the original. Cheers, one shot. If you sip it, I swear to God. If cool, you you're gonna it, punch me? Uh, well, well, why? Why would you? <laughs> I'm not You're an punching? abusive Korean boyfriend, all right? Sure. <laughs> Cheers. Help. Cheers, y'all. I love you. <laughs> Sarangye. Ready? Three, two, one. Thanks for joining us in all our mukbangs, guys. This is for you. Love. 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 
Love, Honestly, love, she really doesn't love, want to drink love, this right now. Love. So you got to understand how much she's doing for you guys, right? Ah. Go. I helped you out. I dropped a little bit. You did it. No. Oh. I feel sick just thinking about this. The first shot was really gross-ish. It's a really sweet custard. Okay. Mmm. Wow. Mm. Oh. Oh, see that one tastes better for me than the flavored one. Oh, really? So you're telling me it's the clear ones though. are good. I have this last one. It's a clear one. I don't know the difference between the original and the fresh flavor. Oh, Maybe no, they no. use fresher water to distill it. I have no idea. You know what guys? I'm, I'll probably just drink from the bottle because it's just a lot easier. Cheers. Drink responsibly. How is, that? <laughs> is that worse? It's pretty, no, that's okay. Honestly, it does, it's not as bad as like a Belvedere or a Grey Goose. See, I prefer like Grey Goose or Belvedere over but Soju. you have to understand that this is like casual drinking drinks, uh -huh. you know? You, if we were eating this food right now and had a mukbang, you couldn't down a, a Belvedere. Like honestly, that would be so but bad. But it just like tastes better. That would be overall. nasty. Like this is really gross to me. Sorry to like Soju lovers, but... No, 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 yeah. no, 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 no. Well, you know, we don't drink alcohol that much. So I think when we need to drink alcohol, we always brace ourselves. We always G ourselves up mm -hmm. and get ready for that event that we're going to go out drinking. Because that's how much we don't drink. We never drink. We I only think drink at events. We, yeah, events or birthday, birthday parties. Yeah. And we only have six friends and only half of them drink. So we only drink three times a year. I'm serious. We only drink three times a year. Maybe when we're younger. Yeah. When I was younger, it would be every week, but now yeah. it's, uh, this, this shit's not good for you. Oh yeah. You like that? Hell yeah. You didn't eat that much though. I finished everything. You're going to get drunk first. Now I want to talk about Korea. Okay. I used to date a Korean. <laughs> <laughs> Are you putting <laughs> yourself up to the viewers right now? <laughs> What kind of drunk do you think I am? Am I silly, funny, annoying? Mm. To be honest. You're a bit know. crazy. You're pretty crazy as I well when you're drunk. Yeah, oh, like really. When John and Twee gets drunk at a club, these two like fight each other at a club. And he always like looks for Twee mm. and just like literally like picks her up and just like throws her over yeah. his shoulder and just like run and me and Luba are just like dying in the corner. Like, what is happening? And then those two are just so she, funny when they're drunk. Like, she just pisses me off sometimes. You know, I don't know what it is. It's probably the face. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. She's awesome. It's just that's the kind of relationship. That's just how yeah. they joke with each other. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. More physical, I guess. But um, I do it with everyone. Apparently, I'm a type that just like kind of grabs him, yeah. gets him in a headlock, and I'm like, yeah, I'm one of those annoying guys yeah. when I'm drunk. But you're the type that would um, slap someone when you're really drunk. If uh, they weren't listening to you. Not slap. A lot of screaming. Yeah, I scream. I yeah. yell a lot. I'll be like screaming in like Kelvin and Simon's face. I'll just be like, yeah. drink with me now. And like just yeah, like yeah, yeah. scream in their face. And then they'll try to like run away from me. Guys, you don't understand. Like, um, probably the hardest person to control when she's drunk. And I'm so thankful that she never picks on me and never makes me drink. And yeah, I, exactly. And See, that's I one of the reasons you. why I love you because you don't bully me because she's just, you can, oh my God. You can ask any of our friends when she drinks, she turns into a demon and everyone tries to just run that's away. That's my nickname. They kind of see her and they're like, oh, it's demon, we're out of here. Demon Delina. Demon Delina. That's what they call her when she drinks. Demon Delina. <laughs> So yeah. this is He's the, not even exaggerating. The game you do. So you, you flick it and then you go like that and then you pass it on to the next person and they have a shot to flick it and whoever flicks it off doesn't have to drink. So I'll go first. So you go like that. Oh, whoever. So if I, if I flick it off, you have to drink. If you flick it off. Really? Yeah. Is that how it works? Yeah. Oh. We'll keep going. Wait, no, no, that was, that was a flick. That was a flick. It wasn't. You're drinking. I didn't even get to which do one my do you flick. Want? Which one do you want? I didn't get to original do my flick. Original or fruit? Which one would you like? <laughs> original you or fruit? No, 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 you already lost. <laughs> you already lost. <laughs> 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 which 
Which one do you want? This. Which one do you want? Half. You can do half. Yeah, that's cheating. How is it cheating? Rules are rules. I didn't make this. The Koreans did. Let's go. Rules are rules. I thought you said if you flick it off, you drink. That's the rules. No, if you flick it off, you don't have no, to drink. No, if you flick it off, you drink. That's what Kelvin said. Oh. Yeah. But I changed the rules. But see, you can't. But, because you but, said in Korea. But rules in this rules. videos, I made that rule. So that was the rule. No, you're not allowed to. Yeah, you have to drink. Half. You have to drink. You, okay, fine. We'll drink half each then. No, you drink it. No, you have to drink I'm half. eating my bun. What bun? This. <gasps> don't! <laughs> no, I don't want anymore. You said I only had to do three shots. See how she is, guys? Our friends. If our friends watching this, see how she is? She makes you guys drink so much all the time. Are you serious? Bring and me. And then I when guess. I try to make her drink a little bit. I don't want to drink soju. It's a big problem. I don't want to drink soju. I'll drink Jaeger or Belvedere if you bring it here. Well. And I always drink when my friends drink Jaeger and Belvedere with me. Ugh. I shouldn't have ate something so sweet and then drank that because it would like amplify the taste. I haven't tried that. Can I try that please? What? The soju? No, the bun. Oh, this one. Okay. It is a milky custard bun. There you go. There you go. Thank you. Anyway, this is uh, only our fourth or fifth day in Korea. Do you like it? No, I have, I'm thirsty. Oh, okay. And uh, we're having the time of our life. I'm not, to be honest, I'm not even that tipsy right now. This is not enough alcohol. I think I have to finish at least two bottles and then I'll start acting really ridiculous. Finish I'll probably, it then. I'll probably start humping like this soju thing right here. Finish it then. What? I'll finish it if you... Okay. I'll finish... Oh. No, I'm not finishing anything. I'll finish all of this if you do one shot. <laughs> so it's up to her, guys, if you if you want to make that okay, happen. Okay, go, go finish all that. I'll do a shot. I need to see you do the shot first before I drink it. I'm not dumb. <laughs> I ain't stupid. <laughs> Who do you... Look. Look. <laughs> What did you even say? It came out I was like That was Korean, bro. Birth, that was something. Korean. You didn't know Korean? That was Korean. Oh my god. Anything you wanna tell our fans? You're the crazy one out of this relationship. I'm the crazy one. Yeah. Of course I'm the crazy yeah. one. Yeah. Listen, I'm the type And everyone knows what I have to go through. Like you know how John is. I think one of the most grateful things is that you're not weirded out by me and one of the things I do that's really weird is talk to myself and she never calls me out on it did you know that? no like I always make sounds yeah. by myself like when I'm downstairs I'm always like yeah. 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 yeah but that's just you oh really? yeah yeah so I'm like you oh really? yeah okay and sometimes I talk to myself a bit yeah and is that's it? why I'm always like huh? like did you say something? you're like oh. uh. I think I do have ADD though, definitely, because I can never stay in one spot and I also uh -huh. have some weird tendencies to like, be insane. <laughs> <laughs> Why did it get awkward? It didn't, what? it wasn't awkward. Oh, it was it? It was just like a silent. Oh like... really, just a bit of silence? Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, the next few days we have some crazy stuff coming up. We're gonna do one more uh, in an interesting hotel accommodation type, yeah. and then we're gonna go straight into the food. And maybe some food. luxury hotels since we haven't done any yet. Because food. some people food. like that. Yeah, I mean, I feel like our audience is quite mixed. Like, you know, some people really love the cheap eats, some people really love expensive eats, some people love cheap hotels, some people love expensive hotels. So we always like to do both. Another thing that Delena hates about me a lot is, um, when I walk up the stairs, I leave black marks on the carpet. Every time after gym or after walking and I wear socks, the cotton kind of sticks to my foot and I walk up the stairs and it leaves black footprints like a big foot. And she gets very upset at that, but it's not my fault. I just, I sweat from my, the, the bottom of my feet sometimes. And then it kind of like gets stuck. And I don't know why. I've never sweated in my life, to be honest, to 27, 26 maybe. I didn't sweat from anywhere except maybe one bead from my forehead, one here on my nose, and that's it. But now... Maybe because you're older. The pores are opening. Because like, I don't sweat either, which is really weird. You're, you don't sweat a drop. Like, it's really weird. I, like, maybe 40 I degree heat. look it up. Is 40, that normal? 40 degree heat, uh, exercise, out in the sun, 
and she doesn't sweat anywhere. Like, where does it go? Do we have any that doctors that watch us? Yeah, is that a normal thing? If you're I watching us, Google it later. Yeah, tell us why she doesn't sweat. Yeah. Does she? I mean, not I'd like have... to sweat because doesn't sweat make you like lose weight and stuff? Is it because you don't have sweat glands? You have no little dots that lets the sweat come out, it or maybe not. your body eats the sweat. My body eats everything. That's true. What do you have there? I have my favorite hockey. Favorite. This one's really good. You know what? I don't drink a lot, but it's. I guess I see the appeal to it. And uh, but it's you so like cheap. soju. Mm, mm. Like you and Calvin drink a lot of soju together. Calvin drinks a lot of soju as well. So, do you want to try mum? What? No, nah, it's okay. I don't eat too many sweets anymore. Listen guys, another question is, how do you guys eat so much but not gain any weight? Mm. When I look in the mirror, I see a fat boy, so I don't know what you're talking we about. We do gain weight, guys. We definitely gain weight. Oh, I'm mentioning about your socks. Do you know how hard it is to vacuum on carpet? It's a lot of work. He doesn't know because he doesn't do any of the cleaning I do the entire cleaning of the whole house and just vacuuming is really hard and that's why you know i'm like please like try not to leave like those marks there's just like what was black, i talking black, about black 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 what was i talking about you're talking about why we get so fat oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Something like majority that. of the comments another one is how do you guys eat so much and not lose weight gain weight <laughs> 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 How do you not lose weight? We gain weight, guys. Yeah. I'm like at the start of the trip, maybe not so much, but by the end of it, it, it the double chin comes out, the flab rolls come out. I start looking like a muffin top. How do we keep the weight off? Sometimes we just exercise a lot. But you know how much I have to train. It's just. But to be honest, John gains weight really easily compared to me yeah yeah you so, have a fast metabolism mine is so slow it's been so slow since i was a little kid you don't understand how much okay guys I, this is my daily workout routine when i'm back in australia it's gym for two hours then i have volleyball then i take jack for a run and i don't lose any weight i just maintain so imagine if i didn't do any of that and i was eating the amount of foods i would be really I'll be kind of like this you know I'll be massive and it sucks that I have to exercise so much uh, when I come here though before we go on a trip mm. to full work I always usually train for size so I kind of look a little bit bulkier and more bloated but then as I stop training I lose like muscle mass and also water weight and I kind of thin down a tiny bit I guess yeah and we walk so much too. We're constantly yeah. walking when on the streets. When we're overseas, we pretty much walk everywhere. We walk everywhere. So we don't like taking yeah. uh, public transport too much. We never take taxis if we don't have to. So if we need to get to A to B and it's less than 30 minutes, yeah. we always walk. Always walk. Even like last time when we were in Hong Kong, we walked for 40 minutes. We walked like for 40 from minutes. From one place to another place, 40 minutes, and then back another 40 minutes. So we just, we just walk everywhere. so it's pretty good oh and saves you money as well you good soju what's your favorite flavor of soju have you tried more uh the fruit flavors are the best because it doesn't taste like alcohol and it's easy to down anything like that is good what do you have there this is a another thing that helps me keep the weight off which is uh like this is i think this is like a wheat tea but usually i drink green tea a lot it's just antioxidants helps cut the fat down and make you feel a lot better after a really greasy meal. I'm, I'm telling you guys, tea is king. Make sure you guys drink a lot of tea and keep hydrated and that's how you lose weight. I actually like don't like tea. Yeah. Does anyone else not like tea or is it just me? We don't drink coffee. We don't that's drink another coffee. thing we don't I drink. drink coffee. Uh, I drink tea, she doesn't drink tea. Mm -hmm. And we also have never had any butt fun. So. <laughs> What does that even mean? <laughs> Not that I'm disappointed. But if the option was available, it would what? be nice. What? Did you say butt fun? What? No. Oh, what did you say? What are you talking about? What did you say then? I said butt fun. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, guys. 
I know everyone is wondering. Chani. Chani. Where? What are the Korean bays like? Well, I will tell you. Pretty, pretty good. No, <laughs> the girls are actually really pretty here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, listen, we have a relationship where we have zero jealousy between us. Oh. We're never jealous. No. When you talk to a guy, uh, when you do flirty stuff with a guy, I could not. I don't. Care it's us. not flirty. Let's say, but uh, even if you did, I wouldn't care that much. Because... But I don't flirt with other people. All right. It's like. Do you get jealous like, of me when I? No. So, I don't flirt though, so it's not my style. Excuse me, you do. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> we don't flirt with anyone. Like you know, we might be like really friendly, and mm. some people might take it as flirting, but it's not flirting. Like I'm a really friendly person, and John is okay. Yeah, I'm not friendly. We're not friendly. Anyway, what was I talking about? I swear I was talking about but, something. Oh yeah, the Korean base. Uh, we went to the MMA awards, as you guys saw, and uh, a lot of, oh, not really. They were all just like youngins having fun. Oh my God, BTS were crazy, man. I never, I just thought BTS were pretty boys that had some catchy songs, that's it. But no, they're so freaking talented. Amazingly talented. But some areas in Gangnam especially, there's a lot of hot bays in Korea. So if you like the Korean type, come down. Yeah, a lot I of eye candy. But it's a lot. It's also plastic surgery. A lot of plastic surgery. Yeah. Would I get plastic surgery? Would no. we get plastic surgery? If I did, no. where? Mm. If I did, where? Downstairs. Nah. Make my butthole smaller. Ew, <laughs> no, no, no. You Everyone's... know, um, I actually got offered a plastic surgery like sponsorship gig where they're like, oh, you know, we'll fly you down to Korea. You don't need it. Um, to get plastic surgery, you just have to film the whole procedure, pick what you want to get done. You can get like your face done, nose, eyes, boobs, but anything How are you, you, how are you gonna done, make the most okay? perfect girl even prettier? And then, Impossible. It's like leveling up to 100% and you want to go more? How? No, 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 no way. I have like nothing against people who want to get plastic surgery, but a personal opinion is, I would never get plastic surgery. I just can't like even like the thought of like being cut. Like I can't do that. Yeah. So, yeah. She hates pain. Yeah. She hates bugs. She hates pain. Even bruises are damaging to her. Uh, a little like she has no pain tolerance. Yeah, like this, it's tiny. No. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't. See, she can't even handle that. So I'm wearing like four layers, so I'm protected. Oh really? Yeah. Oh that. Protect. I'll abuse you. I will abuse you. <laughs> That's how abusive I am. I don't even know how to say it properly. I will abuse you, bro. You better listen to me. Or what? Right. I'm an abusive drunk. No, I'm not. Well, My dad was an abusive drunk. <laughs> I feel like this video is like... It's going, going places around. that Up you never down. knew where it was going. Hmm. Well, since you guys have been watching this far, let's share some more yeah. deep secrets. We'll go deeper. Yeah, we'll go deeper. So my dad was pretty intense when he was younger. I think it had to do with being a foreigner in a new country, trying to make a living. So he drank a lot and he was quite intense. And as a youngin, I got beat. I ain't gonna lie, I got hit a lot, but I grew a thick skin from it and I also learned discipline. But although I would never in my whole entire life, when I have kids, I would never do anything to harm them. I might call them fat sometimes if they're just like scoffing down those donuts. Like me. <laughs> yeah, but that's it. <laughs> no, I shouldn't say that. I shouldn't. <laughs> Where's this going? I don't know. I'm going. This bye is bye. really sad. I feel sad now. Oh, yeah. It's such a good shot, though. Is it? Yeah, it's a really mm -hmm. good shot. shot. Yeah. How about if I do it like this? Am I like a, a soju? Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm a soju model. Pretty cool. uh, I look like a black leech on top of a soju bottle. Oh, no. Oh. But I love my dad and he is a very kind man now. He's so funny and that's why we grew a lot closer. I love your dad. He's really nice. He's yeah, really I nice think he guy. just had some crazy rage problems like a lot of Asian people. Uh, when they drink too much alcohol, they just get angry and they take it out on certain people. 
And, uh, but now he's learned to calm down. And I don't know what it is, but he's become such a cheerful, happy person. And he's chosen a different path and I'm so happy for him. Did you know Delena has never been hit in her entire life? I've been hit like, by you. Wow! What the? You want to, if you want to be hit for real, then I might as well hit you. <laughs> How dare you say that stuff? I'm kidding. When have I ever hit you? I'm joking. God. Oh my God. You were joking as well. You said I went around punching people and stuff. I've seen you slap people though. What do you mean Not on the people? face. I mean like on the arm, like. Oh like yeah, that. I'll just be like, come drink, come drink. Like yeah. This. yeah. Not and, like actually slap them. And you the kicked face. someone in the chest in overseas once. Cause he was um, perving on Twee. Yeah. Like six inch uh, high heels. Freaking Sparta kicked someone in the <laughs> chest because she was, uh, the guy, sorry, was trying to like fill up one of us. No, friends. he was like already feeling her up. Did you burp? No, I didn't. You didn't burp? No, he no. was already feeling her up and I was really upset because I'm really protective when it comes to like my friends and everything. Yeah. So if a sleazy dude just like comes up and like actually like grabs you like this and like starts to touch you, I'm like, what the hell, you know? Yeah. Like, who does that? And Delena was like, this is Delena and high heel kicked him in the chest. And he was very, uh, very hurt by that. He ran away afterwards. That was- Well, you just kicked me before. Yeah, because you, you said I was abusive. Anyway, moving on. Which kind of makes no sense because I kicked you. But anyway, this concludes our soju mukbang. I knew it was going to head towards a weird direction was it? once I started drinking. Some of my feelings come out. Um, <laughs> what else can we share? Well, I thought we were concluding it. Oh, I don't want to conclude it. Oh, you don't want to conclude yeah. it yet? You can have another shot and then we can keep talking. I'm done with shots. I clearly am speaking complete nonsense. I'm not drunk. I'm, I'm just maybe 10% tipsy. So I'm letting a few things slide. But oh. um, yeah, I'm not that bad, to be honest. No, you're fine. I know you're fine. Yeah. I mean, it's only like, what, six soju shots? If I actually got drunk from that, a lot of people would probably laugh at me. But... Some people are really lightweight though. Yeah, they are. We have, yeah, we know some people that three shots and it's over. Mm. Which is good because you don't need to spend that much money on alcohol to get drunk. Oh, and also one of Delena's friends, she's so funny. When she drinks alcohol, she sips it. So she gets a tequila shot. And you know, oh, you, if you drink a te tequila <laughs> shot, you want to down that and get rid of it as soon as possible. She's like this, she's like, oh, it's really bad. <laughs> she's Ooh. so funny she's like the sweetest girl ever she, and then, it's hilarious I'll, i die i'm I'll, like why are you torturing yourself it's so funny yeah like when you do a shot you just want to finish it but mm. i gave her an abc shot i don't know if you guys know what that is that's absence bacardi and citrus Ooh. in one shot okay disgusting and usually you're that meant to just like down it but then she's just like sips really slowly and i'm just like i can't look at her do it because it's like it's a pretty bad drink but it's like good when you just like down it all at once so it's yeah good. um why did you choose to dye your hair red we're talking a lot lately yeah i like it good times. i feel like i'm a lot more comfortable in front of the camera now and it's honestly really fun and enjoyable just speaking to like the camera knowing that like you guys are watching it and it's like i'm actually speaking to you yeah guys. the way i see it is like i'm not looking into a camera lens i'm actually seeing a, a crowd a, yeah. a certain kind of like seeing through the screen and i'm seeing you guys completely naked maybe in your underwear and it makes me a lot more comfortable and that's why i feel so yeah. comfortable chatting to the camera it's you know? yeah it's really I nice i see you in those boxes See, I some see of, what you're some doing. Some of you are on the toilet right now. I see now. what you're doing. Some of you are on the toilet like this, like, oh shit, He's, he sees me. We should just like, <laughs> we should just, like look yeah, at the camera ready, and be ready, like, ready, creepy. Ready. Ooh. <laughs> anyway, um, great time. I hope you guys enjoyed yes. the soju, soju mukbang. mukbang. This is the Mini first time mukbang. we've ever, well, kind of like drank and then... Yeah, I don't think we've ever had alcohol on screen and uh, there's a lot of challenges where you can drink a lot, but it's not that kind of thing. So this was a first for us. I hope you enjoyed it. None of us are really that insane though. I feel like if I had maybe five more shots, I would pull my pants down. But you know no what? No one wants to I'm see that. No, everyone wants to see that. Oh, actually it's already on your like Chonny videos. Did you know anyway. I have a third nipple on my butt cheek? I have actually a nipple on my butt cheek. No, you don't. Do you want to see? Let's show them. 
No, your butt is in your other videos as well. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's true. Yeah. I do. He it, does a lot of crazy stuff on his in the um, comedy other videos. channel. So yeah, 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 yeah. if you want to see crazy Chani, make sure you watch Chani, the comedy videos. My Chani, K-pop Chani, good times, gaming Chani. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this mini mukbang yes. and soju room. We love it so much. Oh yeah, I can't wait to sleep in it. We'll just drown ourselves in alcohol. Oh, oh champagne showers. <laughs> anyway, I hope you have a great week. Thanks Enjoy for your watching, food. Guys. Take care. Bye. Bye. See ya. Mm. Soju kisses. Oh. <laughs>